spirit to give me the strength I need. When I fall on my knees, I know that you will rescue me. I need your Holy Spirit down in my soul. God bless you, Minister Charlie. You click yeah. right on <laughs> at the right you. time. God bless you tonight. Welcome to Walking in the Scriptures and Speaking the Truth. Oh, and my little God sister, where have you been, Lady Laquita Nichols? <laughs> hey, darling. Good to see you tonight as well. I hope everything is well with you ladies tonight. I hope your families are well. And I hope you have had a blessed and marvelous day. We get ready to get started. And we're going to let other people come on in and jump on in. As we uh, begin to have our opening scripture. We're going to read an old familiar passage of scripture for the voices of Watts. Once upon a time, we sung a song. I forget the name of the young lady. Uh, was it Robin? I think it was. Robin Greenwood wrote this song. Judge me, O Lord, for mm -hmm. I have walked in my iniquity. I have trusted also in the Lord. Therefore, I shall not slide. Examine me, O Lord, and prove me. Try my reins and my heart. For thy loving kindness is before mine eyes, and I have walked in thy truth. I have not sat with vain persons, neither will I go in with dissimilars. I have hated the congregation of evildoers and will not sit with the wicked. Mm -hmm. I will wash my hands in innocency, so will I come past thy altar, O Lord, that I may publish with the voice of thanksgiving and tell of all thy wondrous work, works. Lord, I have loved the habitation of thy house and the place where thine honor dwelleth. Gather not my soul with sinners, nor my life with bloody men, in whose hand is mischief, and their right hand is full of bribes. But as for me, I will walk in my integrity. Redeem me and be merciful unto me. My foot standeth in an even place. In the congregation will I bless the Lord. I just read you the 26th number of Psalms. Mm -hmm. May the Lord bless the reader and the hearer of his word. Let us pray. God, we thank you, Master. Yes, God. In the name of Jesus yes. for this time and this place. For this session tonight, God, we just thank you for the assignment. Yes, yes Lord. We thank you for taking care of us throughout this day. Yes, thank you, God. How you blessed us as we went to and from our different locations and destinies today, God. We thank yes. you for giving us, oh God, your protection. And you for undergirding us and strengthening us, God, and keeping us like only you can. Mm -hmm. We confess that we've sinned and, and come short today. We said and done some things, Lord, that was displeasing to you. And we Merci repent yes. right now of all our uh, evilness, all our wickedness, all the sins we've committed, God. Yes, the things yes. we came out of our mouth that was not like you, the, our nasty attitude, God, forgive us for yes. what we thought and how we acted, God, in the name of, in Jesus. Name of Jesus. Wash us, purge us, cleanse us, and purify us, Lord, from all unrighteousness, Lord, from all sin and from all dead works. We invite you in this session tonight yes, God. to have your way Let me in, Lord. to, oh God, to, oh God, orchestrate. Uh, to perform miracles, God, yes. to teach your hidden truths to make known to your people. Yes. Let your word, God, be seated into good ground. Yes, God. Let people, oh God, embrace your word, God. Yes, experience God. your presence. And, oh God, experience in your manifestation. Yes. 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 I pray yes. tonight that you would, oh God, survey the audience, God. Yes. Whatever is needful in that home, God. Yes. Whatever is needful on that job, God. Yes. Whatever yes. is needful in that body, God. Yes. Ah, yes. Perform miracles tonight. Miracles, God. In the name of, name Jesus. of Jesus. Arrest tonight. Yes. Save tonight. Save oh God, deliver tonight. Yes. Set free tonight. Yes, Heal tonight. Heal, in Jesus' mighty name. Jesus. 
Jesus' mighty God, name. God, we decrease now, Lord. Yes. You increase in yes. us. Yes, Lord. God, teach us your hidden truths, God. Yes, God. Give us the revelation wisdom of your word, God. Yes. Give us the spirit of our, uh, uh, and the knowledge, oh God, of the word of knowledge and the spirit of, of the word to come forth, God. Yes, Unhidden God. and unchecked, God. Yes. In the name of Jesus. Let there be a revival in us. Get God Almighty. In us, yeah. Let it be a revival in us, God. A revival in us. Oh, yes, God, God, we want to uh, bring you uh, praise and glory. Yes, God. Let us not be ashamed to own you, God. Hallelujah. Let us be boldly for you, God. Yes, God. In the name of the Jesus, name we of pray. Jesus. God, we decreed and we declared being so. Yes. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of and every heart can say, Thank God. Thank God. God. Amen. 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 And amen. 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 It's an honor to have you all on tonight. Minister Brenda Hardy has just tuned in tonight. Those are some saving place holiness. Yeah, that's it. People that's of God it. over there. Uh, where Pastor James Williams and First Lady Elect uh, Patricia Williams are the pastors of that church and yes. dynamic church full of the Holy Ghost. Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, Fire, little, little, little full of power and anointed Ooh, in that church. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Ah. Thank God tonight for you yes, who are sitting in yes. the background and like we do at church, we want to, we don't want to come up close, but we just thank God that you're here tonight. Yes. And for those who will come on later, we thank God for you tuning in <coughs> after this. And at this time, we're going to go ahead and turn over our Bible class, walking in the scriptures and speaking the truth with our own, with my own pastor, Pastor Geneva Alexander. And God bless you, uh, oh, Pastor Ernie Williams. All right, she's just saying that. Just in. <laughs> God bless you, sweetie. Bless what is you. Laquita saying? She said, hey, Mom and, uh, and God, Sister Love. What you say that? Back I'm here. at work in the park on lot. Oh, all right, Watching darling. the clock. Okay, <laughs> God bless you. I'm glad mm -hmm. she's at work. Like I said, thank God for social media because it reaches everywhere. She's at work in the park on lot watching this broadcast way over there in Los Angeles. And we just thank God for her tuning in tonight. Yes. At this time, we're in the hands of our teacher. God bless you tonight. Welcome again. Tonight, we greet you with the spirit of love. And we greet you in the name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, and in the power of the Holy Ghost. Yes. We're so grateful that you're with us tonight. And we, last week, we talked. We had a good subject, I think, because we had a, 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 a subject was that will hit us all. Total committed. Yes. Last week, total committed. See, God wants us to be total committed to him, not halfway, not part of the way, but total committed to him. And so we, 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 we went through that, and I hope that some of you got something out of that so that you can commit yourself totally to the Lord. Amen. It's not hard to do. The hard part about it is what? To make up your mind to do it. Amen. Right. Amen. 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 Tonight, we have another good uh, subject tonight, and it's um, the goodness of God. Yes. Mm -hmm. The goodness of God. People don't realize now how really good God is because they think now that they're doing stuff on their own. Right. They don't, it's good. They don't, they don't keep him in the equation. Mm -hmm. And so they, they need to know it's God's goodness that he allows us to be who we are, yes. what we are, and how we are. Mm -hmm. He allows that to be. Amen. Yes. And so God is in excellent condition tonight. Yes, he is. He doesn't need no help from anybody. Okay. He's no, sound. He he's superior. Higher than uh, standard. Mm -hmm. uh, he's high in quality. He's attractive. Mm -hmm. Yes, he is. Yeah. Uh huh. Complete in skill. Yes. In quality. Mm hmm. And complete in everything. Mm hmm. Uh, even though he's valid and he's true, he's pleasant. He's joy enjoyable. Yes, he he's is. He's favorable. Yes, he is. He's upright. Yes, he is. And in excellent condition. Yes, he is. Because he's God. Yes, he is. And he is our Lord and he's our Savior. So he's everything, everything. that we need. Yes. I don't care what you need. God's got it. Yes. Amen. All we got to do is supply him with what? Faith. Faith. Trust, hope, and belief. And when we do that, God will work for us. Amen. Yes. Upright is directions or, or, or stance, uh, erect in posture or character, carriage uh, morally, respectful, mm, honorable, 
Mm -hmm. Standing upright, not not twisted, but standing upright, mm -hmm. straightforward. Amen. Right. And that's what God is all about. He has nothing to hide. Mm -hmm. Nothing to hide. Mm -hmm. Like some of us. Amen. Jesus. Amen. Some of us can hide some stuff that ain't good. My Lord Jesus. Amen. So we need to come out the corner. Amen. Yes. All right. Let's go to our scripture tonight. It's found in Psalms 25, 8 through 13. Psalms. The Old Testament, 25, 8 through 13, and it reads as thus, Good and upright is the Lord. Mm -hmm. Therefore will he teach sinners in the way. Okay. The meek will he judge in judgment. I'm sorry. Right. Wait, the meek will he guide in judgment, mm -hmm. and the meek will he teach his way. Okay. All the paths of the Lord are mercy and truth unto such as keep his covenant and his testimony. That's it right there. God is upright. We just mm -hmm. told you how upright that he is. Yes. He, he's Lord. Because therefore, he, he, uh, will he teach sinners? Now, he's not talking about that rank sinner that have never known him. He's talking about us. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh -huh. We talk about us because we all what? Have sinners sinned. Mm -hmm. Saved short. by grace. Uh -huh. We're sinners saved, saved by, by grace. grace. Mm -hmm. So we all have sinned and come, come short, short of the glory of God. Mm -hmm. We're still sinning and coming short mm -hmm. of the glory of God. Amen? Yes, and so he says, therefore will he teach sinners in the way. Mm -hmm. In the way that what? He should go. He ought to go. He right. shall go. Amen. Mm -hmm. And so he's saying here, all the paths of the Lord are mercy and truth. And truth. Uh -huh, unto such as, as keep his covenant, covenant and, his and his testimonies. testimonies. All the paths are in what? True truth. truth. When we Mercy keep, and truth. Uh -huh. when, 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 when we keep his commandments, when we keep his covenant, when we keep his truth, amen. And so it's not hard to do that, amen. It's easy to do it. You just got to have a mind made up to do it. Mm -hmm. He says, all the paths of the Lord are mercy and truth unto such as keep as his covenant and his what, testimony. That's one thing, beloved, we do not testify enough about God. That's true. I mean, we just will not tell folks the goodness of God. One thing I like about the Saving Place Church, they don't mind telling them how good God is. <laughs> yes. They don't mind telling them what God has done for them. Right. And they tell it with such conviction till you just get to shouting on their own testimony. Amen. Right. Exactly. They don't have to shout alone because they're so anointed right. uh, that it just fills the house. Yes, it does. But you don't have to be anointed to tell the goodness of God. Right. Just learn how to tell the goodness. Read on. For thy sake, for thy name's sake, O Lord, pardon my iniquity, for it is great. Wait a minute. For thy name's sake, O Lord, pardon my iniquity, pardon my transgression. In other words, you are confessing to yes. God. Yes. And constantly. a lot of times we don't confess because we don't think we've done anything. Mm -hmm. My Lord Jesus. But honey, we sin, I mean, every day, all day, at, I mean, just all the time because little things come into our minds. And sometimes we entertain those things. Right, exactly. We don't dismiss them. We just sit up there and entertain them. Right. And then we find out later we've sinned. We've sinned, exactly. And still we don't what? Ask God to forgive, to forgive us. us. Right. Amen. Mm -hmm. And so he's saying that here. Um, what verse was that? That was 11. Okay, he says, for, for thy name's sake. Oh, Lord, pardon my iniquity. Now, mm -hmm. we know we got some iniquities. Mm -hmm. We know we got some wrongdoing in us. Because we're not perfect yet. Is that right? Right. We're striving to be. Yeah. But we haven't got there. Right. And we won't get there until Jesus meets us in the sky. Right. Oh, glory to God. When what? We were caught up to meet him. Right. And that's when we will be what? Saved. Mm -hmm. Sanctified and truly holy. Yes. When he called us up to meet him. Amen. Mm -hmm. Read on the next one. What man is he that feareth the Lord? Him shall he teach in the way that he shall choose. Now, 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 what man is he that what feareth? feareth. That Reverence. what man is he that reverence God? What mm -hmm. man is he that trusts in God? Mm -hmm. What man is he that believe in God? Mm -hmm. Him shall he teach in what the way, way that he that he should, should and ought to, and he must go. He shall choose. Uh -huh. Okay, he, that's right. He to choose. And so what happened is we have got to be taught because we don't know nothing. Yes. We got to be taught. Amen. Because mm -hmm. we don't know nothing. And when we think we know, we still don't, still know. don't know. Amen. 
So God has to always give us a lesson. Yes. We, know <laughs> we can always part. have a lesson going on. Mm -hmm. Because we don't know everything God would have us to know. We only know in part. That's in what part. Said. In mm -hmm. part. Amen. Mm -hmm. All right. The next one says what? His soul shall dwell at ease and his seed shall inherit the earth. Your soul shall dwell in ease. Uh -huh. At ease. In righteousness. In security. That's what it's talking about. And your, and your offsprings will inherit the earth. Mm -hmm. Amen. We need to leave them something uh -huh, to, to, uh -huh, to feast on while we're gone. Amen. Mm -hmm. And that's Jesus. We need to teach our children, our loved ones, everybody's connected to us about the sweet name of Jesus, the yes. goodness of God. Yes. We don't tell folks and we don't teach them about the goodness of God. It's all about some person or somebody else. Mm -hmm. But it's never... Uh, talking to you, to God, do you know God? I want you to know who God is. Sit him down and teach him. Right. Because this world is getting in a terrible condition. Oh, yes, oh, yes. Because God is not in so many of them, in their lives. Mm -hmm. and, 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 and it's hard on us when we see our children lost. Right. When we see our children confused and don't know who they are. Right. Don't know whose they are. Right. Oh, beloved, we got to teach our children. Amen. Mm -hmm. His soul shall dwell at ease. He'll be in safety. He'll be in security. He'll be in righteousness. Uh -huh. And his seed shall in what? Hurry the earth. Amen. Mm -hmm. All right. Our next scripture we're going to is um, Psalms 119, 31 through 35. All right. Let's read that. Again, Psalms 119, 31 through 35. And it reads, I have stuck unto thy testimonies. Okay. O Lord, put me not to shame. I will run the way of thy commandments when thou shalt enlarge my heart. My God. Teach me, O Lord. Teach me. The way of thy statutes, and I shall keep it unto the end. Give me understanding, and I shall keep thy law. Yea, I shall observe it. With my whole heart. Mm. Make me to go on in the path of thy commandments. For therein do I delight. Yes. Okay. I have chosen the way of truth. It's a choice. Yeah. It's a choice. It's a choice. It's a choice. And so when you choose the way of truth. The judgments have I what? Laid before me. I, I, I lay before his judgments. Because why? I want to be in the right, right place. Yes. I want to be in the right frame of mind with yes. God, mind. Amen. Not my mind. Right. But his mind. Yes. Ashando. And I will, I have stuck unto what? The testimony. See this this person. Cleave. I, I have just been there. Mm -hmm. I've been talking about it. I've been telling people about you, God. I know about you because why? I tried you. Mm -hmm. You can't know about something unless you try. Unless you try. Exactly. You got to try. You got to know it in order try. to know it right. Mm -hmm. You got to try. It says, I will what? I will run the ways of thy commandment. Mm -hmm. I will run in the way your commandments tell me to go. Mm -hmm. When it teaches me to go. Amen. I'll run. I'll get in a hurry. Amen. Mm -hmm. I'll be zealous. Mm -hmm. I, will en uh, I will enlarge my territory. I will go where you tell me to go. When thou shalt enlarge my heart. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're going to make my heart big. In other words, you're going to bless me. Mm -hmm. Oh, my <laughs> God. You're going to bless me. That's what it's talking about. I enlarge my heart. Then it says, teach me, O oh Lord. Yes. The ways of thy statutes. Mm -hmm. Which, Lord, I want to know everything about you. I want to know all about you. I want to know everything that I need to know about you. Teach me thy statutes. Mm -hmm. And I shall what? Keep it until the end. I'm going to keep it until the end. Mm -hmm. Oh, bless God. Yes. I've learned about him, y'all, and now I'm going to stay with him till the end. Right. When you don't know who he is, you go dipping in and out. Mm -hmm. But when you learn him, mm -hmm. he says, try me. Right. Ooh, and see if I will not what, do great and marvelous things for you. And so he says, teach me, O Lord, thy ways and thy statutes, and I will keep it until the end. Give me what? Understanding. I got to have some understanding. Right. I got to have some wisdom about you. Mm -hmm. I sought the wisdom of God. Mm -hmm. I kept what? Thy law. Mm -hmm. Yea, I shall And what? I shall keep thy law. And I shall keep the law. Yea. Yea. I shall observe it. I shall observe it. With my whole heart. With all of my heart. I will keep your law and I will observe it with all. Make me to go in the path of thy commandment. Mm -hmm. Guide my feet. Keep me on the right path. 
Therein do I delight. I love doing it for you, God. Whatever your will is, I want to do it for the Lord. Amen? You know, it, it's really something because when he says to teach me and then to give me understanding, he said, I shall keep what thy law. Thy law. And the thing about it is a lot of times people just go to church and they may read this, but it don't stick. Well, because they don't know what it's saying. Okay. It can't stick if you don't know what it's saying. That's true. And so, but if you've been taught, mm -hmm. then you'll understand what it's saying and then you'll start to do it. Right. Because like I was going to say, because sometimes people just go to church, yeah. read it, it doesn't stick, it don't penetrate, and you walk out and you end up doing the same thing you were doing before you got to church. You didn't let it stick. Okay. You didn't take it in. Mm -hmm. uh, because you don't think it's talking to you. That's good. That's good. You don't think it's for you. It's for somebody else. Mm -hmm. We always want to pass the book. Right. No, 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 no. When, when the word hits your heart, it's for you. Mm -hmm. when, when, when it calls you to think a little bit, it's for you. Yes. Amen. Amen. And all of this word is for us. I don't care if it's just one verse. Somebody going to get something out of that one verse. That's true. It's because it's directed to all of us. Amen. Yes. Mm -hmm. Make me to go in thy path of, of thy, thy commandments. commandments. For well, therein do, do I, I delight. delight. I love it. Mm -hmm. I praise God for walking in his what? path, walking in his commandments. Amen. Amen. We're going to the next verse. Are we ready to go there? Yes. Which one is that? 34 and 8. It's oh. going to be, uh, no, no, no. Psalms 33 and 5 is what you gave me. Okay. Let's go to 33 and 5. We're going to go. We stand in Psalms tonight, predominantly in Psalms tonight. And uh, God bless you, Minister James Jackson. I see that you have many of your choir members online tonight. Bless you. God bless you. We'll be calling your names uh, toward the end of our um, uh, toward the end of our class. But we just want to welcome you for the first time. For those who are for the first time coming in, and hope that you will be blessed. And that something will be said or done that will inspire you to what to keep walking close with the Lord. Yes. Psalms 33 and 5 says, He loveth righteousness okay. and judgment. The earth is full of the goodness of the Lord. 33 and 5. 33 and 5. Okay, he's talking about righteousness. Righteousness. Mm -hmm. 33 and 5 says, He loveth righteousness. Mm -hmm. Oh, he's in love with righteousness because that's who he is. Yes. He's righteousness. Yes, he is. He's right. He's, he don't have any wrong in him at all. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. And what and he and judgment. Because he wants he's a fair God. Yes. That's why he loves what? Judgment. Judgment. Because he knows the earth is full of what? His goodness. Yes, it is. Of the Lord. Mm -hmm. The earth. If you look around and see how great and how good God is, mm -hmm. oh, it's amazing how how, 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 how wonderful that he is and what he does for us. Yes. All of this earth that he put here is for us. Thank you, Jesus. And, and, and you know what? It's a blessing. Amen. To just look and see right. what the Lord have done. Amen. Mm -hmm. Amen. Oh, and he loves righteousness. So get right, church. And let's go home. <laughs> okay. Get right, church, and let's go home. Amen. Let's let's get right. Let's stay right. Let's act right. Let's be right. And, and God loves righteousness. Amen. Yes, he does. And he's talking to his church. He's not talking to the sinner man right now. Amen. No. Mm -mm. He's talking to you and I. Amen. Yes. We are his people. Right. All right. We're going to go back in Psalms 135. Uh, 145, 145 and 17. 17. Go over to Psalms 145 and verse 17. It says, the Lord is righteous in all his ways and holy in all his works. Mm. Let's see. The, the Lord, Lord is, is righteous, righteous in all his ways and holy in all his works. Good God Almighty. Okay. Uh, righteousness is called his everything. He's everything. God does. What he does is right. Mm -hmm. Everything that he does is right. He cannot do nothing wrong. Yes. He can never do wrong regardless to whatever he does. Mm -hmm. He allows things to happen that's in his permissive will. Yes. Uh, it's not wrong. He just permitted it to happen. Right. That's and, good. Uh, and that's a lot good. of times people uh, get angry with God because they say, why did he let this happen? And why me. did we let this happen? And why did this happen? And why did that happen? It, it, it happens sometimes because... He wants to teach us a lesson. Mm -hmm. 
Because sometimes he'd be telling us all the time what's what's going on, and we don't hear him. Right. We close our ear mm -hmm. to him, and so he has to get our attention. attention. Woo! And sometimes he will use some hard things to some get our attention. And get your attention. Yes. Amen. Amen. He will do that. And and if he keep telling you over and over about something, and you keep doing it, then mm -hmm. then he permits something to happen. Amen. Right. He doesn't cause it to happen. He, he just permitted to he happen. Permits, he permits it he to permits happen. He permits it to happen. So God is righteous. He cannot be no other way because that's just the way that he is. Amen. Yes. Yes. yes Amen. Yes, yes. So don't get angry with him. Uh, you know, just start doing what's right. Yes. And then you, he won't, you won't have to go through some things. Amen. Yeah, because he's an attention getter. Oh, he will get your attention. He knows what button to push. Yeah. And how long to push that button. Mm -hmm. And like you said, if you keep on doing it, then it goes into something a little bit more, what, complicated. Or devastating. Or devastating. Yes. Yeah, it does. It really does. Yes. But it says the Lord is righteous in all his ways uh -huh. and holy, holy in all his works. Yes. Wow. Wow. A holy in all his works. He, he can't do nothing wrong because <laughs> there's no wrong in it. Right. So anytime there's no wrong in a person, they can't do wrong. All right. Let's go to our next scripture. That's 34. Before we, go, before we leave off there. If you are going through something, and maybe you were, like she said, you were angry about something, and what happened is you had a question, and a lot of times back in the old days, they said, you can't question God. <laughs> yeah, no. you can ask the question. And they say, Lord, what is it that I'm doing or what I'm not doing? You Why am I going through this so I would prohibit from keep from what having to go through it? Because sometimes you can... You can um, the, uh, the, the assignment of the suffering period is not long mm -hmm. when you come to yourself. Yeah, right. But you got to come to yourself. When you yourself. recognize something is off or something is not right, when you come to yourself and you ask God some questions, Lord, I'm, well, show me uh, show me, me. Yeah, show me me. Because I got to know because what happens, I don't want to keep going through this because it's too heavy. It's too hard. Oh, right, right. And when you, like I said, come to yourself, watch the... Uh, watch the suffering period what get Easy. canceled. It, it eases up, up or it, or it stops. Mm -hmm. It stops. That's true. That's because true. by that time he would have given you your answer. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, that's very good. And a lot, of, like I said, we we have to go through something in order to get to something. Mm -hmm. And a lot of times that's why God allowed things to happen so we can go through it. Right. And as go and, and while we're going through it, He's teaching us a lesson, and we need to get the lesson. Right. Uh, and, and this is why you can question him on that. Mm -hmm. You can't question him about his godliness. No. Being God. You, you can't question him about that. But you can question him anything that pertains to you. You can ask God about it. Mm. I know I do. God, why did this happen? What's happening? What's going on? What am I doing wrong? What, what's happening? Why is this happening to me? Right. You know, you can ask God that. And, and, and if you have that... Relationship, relationship with him, then he'll, he'll, what, him. he'll tell you. He'll show, he'll tell you. He'll, he'll, show, you. he'll show you. He'll, yes, he he'll will. tell you. He'll talk yes, he to you. Yes, he will. Yes, he will. And, and he'll come to you. He'll reveal it every time. Every time. So so you got to do that. We're going to, we, we fix and use that word again because we're going into our next verse 34. Psalms 34 and 8. eight. And it says, Oh, taste and see that the Lord is good. Blessed is the man that trusteth. In him. Oh, bless his Savior. Continuously yes. trusting him. Oh, now That's see, good. he said, oh, taste and see. Mm -hmm. You cannot taste him like you're eating a, a hamburger. You can't taste him <laughs> like that. Then, again, you've got to have a relationship, relationship. with him Come on. in order to taste him. Mm -hmm. Amen. Because when you, when you have Pushanda, when you have that relationship with him, you'll know how good he is. Hey! This You'll God know Almighty. how blessed you are to yes. be blessed, able to reach him and he reach you back. Right. Woo, glory to God. Oh, taste and see. And then he says, blessed is the man that trusteth in him. Mm -hmm. Don't you know you are a blessed person when you trust God? Yes. When you can't see your way, when right. you don't know what to do, right. you trust God. Yes. He will come through for yes, you. He will. Yes, he will. I'm a witness that he will. <laughs> Y'all talk about oh, blessing. Oh, bless him. <laughs> he will come and see about you. Taste him. 
and get that relationship with him. It doesn't take Thank anything you. but you to say, God, here I am. Mm -hmm. I want to come. I want to be a Christian. I want to be your child. That's all you got to say to right, him. Right. And then tell him, Lord, what? Use me. Make right. me. Mold, mold me. Shape, shape me. me. Into your image and now yes. your life. Yes, yes, yes. You got to tell him that. I don't want to be my own. I don't want to be. Come on. I want to be what you want me to be. Yes. Not what I want to be. Not what I want to be. But let me be what you <laughs> want me to be. Ah, what yes. my destiny here is for. Oh, glory. Yes, God. Yes, Lord. So you Jesus. Can, you, he tastes so good. This is when right. you really know how good he is. Right. When you have that relationship with him. And not only that, you want everybody to have, to have that experience. That's one thing you're not jealous come of. Come on, come on, Pastor. Hey, <laughs> you're not jealous of how much mm -mm. an anointing God put on a person. Right. Or how much that person is what? Used by God. God right. You just want to be in the number. Right. Ooh, glory to God. Right. Lord, while thou art passing on others, do not pass, pass me by. by. Mm -hmm. Do not pass me by. Taste and see yes. that the Lord is good. Ah, Shando, Koro, the mm, yes. He is so good. And I tell you, you can have that relationship with him. And you know what? You don't you just got to just open up your heart. Yes. And let the Lord come in. Yes. Let him in today. Let him in. Let today. him in and stay. Yes. Ooh, he'll Let's suck go. with you. Mm -hmm. Yes, Jesus. he will. He'll teach you. He'll lead you. He'll guide you. Yes, he will. He'll direct you. Yes, he will. He'll save you. He'll set you free. Mm. Taste and see that the Lord is good. <laughs> well, I remember when I was Taste in the hospital and, and, and I was going through a procedure and the Lord came to me and he said those very words to me. Oh, taste and see right. that the Lord is good. Yes. And I began to get a hold of to him, amen. Even mm -hmm. though I had him, but I wanted some more, some of, more him. of him. Because when he came to me and showed me, and he was giving me something out of a cup, mm -hmm. had a table, tablespoon, teaspoon, whatever it was, and he was dipping it out, and I was trying to get every drop. I didn't want it to drop on the floor. Mm -hmm. Praise God, I wanted it all, amen. Right. And that's what I want now. When I taste, of the goodness of Jesus. I just want it all. Right. You never get tired of tasting the goodness of Jesus. He comes yes. in and sucks with you. Yes. He comes in and fellowship with you. Yes. Oh, Jesus. Yes, yes, When yes. you taste and see, see that he's good, mm -hmm. he'll come in and bless your soul. He'll come in and make you whole. You be all. You be ah. all. You be in all. You be in all. You be in all. Yes, you, you be in all. I'm about to get happy here. <laughs> oh, yes, taste and see. Uh -huh. Try me. Uh -huh. Try me. Test me. Test me. Touch me. Uh -huh. Believe Prove me. me. Come uh -huh. on. Receive me. Uh -huh. Ooh, yes, prove me. Yeah. This is what you want God to do. Right. Amen. This is what you want him to do. Touch. And that's when you know he's good. Amen. <laughs> I, I need to ask a question here. How many of you have actually have had a spiritual encounter with God? Bless you. A lot of them. How many of you have had that okay. old taste and see yes. uh, experience? That's right. It's an experience. It's an experience. It's an encounter with God. Yes. Something that is not what usually. Mm-hmm. Oh. It, it comes, does. it comes every now and then. Yes. <laughs> when he'll show himself. Yeah, yeah, that shot. When he'll Ooh. reveal himself. Yes, that's it. And you can't even explain it. it. Right. Your mind can't even comprehend it. That's it. That's ah, it. Oh, taste and see. Yeah. God Almighty. Taste and see. Yeah, 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 yeah. The Lord is good. He's good. He's good. Now yes, that verse is. alone will let you know that you, you can rest assured on yes. that tonight. Yes, yes, yes. That he's good. You can ask him for something and he comes. Ha! Huh. Good God. You have that relationship with him. You, he says, wait on me. I'm coming. Oh, Jesus. Don't get weary and well do it. Wait on me. I'm coming. Wait. Yes. Wait on the Lord. <laughs> and be of good courage. Yes. And he shall what? Strengthen thy heart. heart. Good God Almighty. Yes, Ooh, he will do it. Name. I feel God in here tonight. I do too, Pastor. Ooh, 146, mm -hmm. we're going now. 145 and 6. Okay, that's Psalms 145. Well, uh, 6 through 7. Uh, just 6, right? No, 6 through 7. 145, 6 through 7. Okay, Psalms 145, 6 and 7. It says, And men shall speak of thy might, <laughs> of thy terrible acts. Okay. Hmm. And I will declare thy greatness. Mm -hmm. They shall abundantly utter the memory of thy great goodness and shall sing of thy righteousness. Good God Almighty. Somebody ought to have a song in their heart. Mm -hmm. Come on now. Woo, Jesus. Sometimes you ought to just feel like singing, singing to the Lord when ain't nobody around nobody but you. 
And you just sing until your soul get happy. Amen. That means that you have that relationship with him. He'll put words in your mouth for you to sing to mm -hmm. him. He'll give you some songs and you don't know where they're coming from. Yes. Words are just, ah, no, 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 say, come down from heaven. Yes. And just what, 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 what you said, uh, upload, overload you? Upload. Upload you and download. Download. That's what I'm trying mm -hmm. to say. Download you with, with greatness. Amen. Mm -hmm. And so God is great. We see it right here in the scriptures. Amen. Uh, they shall abundantly utter. What? The memory. Utter. The memory of thy, thy great goodness. goodness. Yeah, you're talking about it all the time. Sometimes it, it's, it gets so good to you. just go. Da, 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 ba, 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 ba. I mean, your mouth just go crazy. Amen. Because you're thinking about it. Amen. Hey, you're uttering. Uh huh. You're not speaking words. You're just uttering sounds. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Sometimes the words won't come, but just oh, no, 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 no. I mean, all of that just comes with it. Amen. Yeah. Because that's where God is, and it says abundantly do the whole lot. Mm -hmm. The memory of thy great goodness. Yes. And shall sing of the righteousness. Mm -hmm. Good God Almighty. And men shall speak of the might of thy what terrible acts. That means awesome. That means he's awesome. In other words, you can't even tell people how awesome that he is. Mm -hmm. You're trying to tell them, but it just don't come out. Because <laughs> mm -hmm. he's just so awesome. Uh -huh. And we'll what? Declare thy greatness. You're going to tell somebody about his greatness. Oh, yeah. You're going to tell it. Oh, I do. Every chance I get, I talk about the goodness of God. Every chance I get. Because he, he, he just he just all of that. Okay, we need to uh -huh, uh -huh, de de declare the goodness of the Lord. Mm -hmm. Make known his deeds. What has he done for you? What has God done for you that you want to tell somebody about? It? Good God am I. Oh, Jesus, have mercy. You know, you, you know those secret things that y'all want to tell somebody? That's the way I feel. I want to tell God about God, <laughs> you know. That stuff you're supposed to keep silent, don't right. talk about. Right. I want to tell right. God about right. it. Right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the way we got to be. Amen? We got to be like that. I hope y'all are getting something here because oh, yeah. I'm getting it. I, 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 ooh, I love God. I love it. 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 She Let's says, come. I really love the Lord. Remember that song? I really love the Lord. The Lord. Yeah, I really love it. I really love the, the Lord. You don't know what he's done for me. Good God Almighty. He said, gave me the victory. I love him. I love him. Oh, I Yes, I do. Really love him. It's not joking. We're not joking. We're not pretending really love him. Because when you love him, you'll keep his commandments. You'll keep his commandments. Oh, and his statutes and his ways. Let's go to uh, sometimes. Jeremiah. Sometimes when the enemy throw a wrench in the program hmm. and try to throw you off balance, that word will pop up and mm -hmm. put you right back. Oh, I can't do that. That's right. I can't say that. It'll keep you in perfect peace. <laughs> yes, it will. Well, mm -hmm. won't it? Yes, it will. So we're going now into the Old Testament still in Jeremiah. Jeremiah 33 and 11. 33 and 11. 33 and 11. And it says, the voice of joy and the voice of gladness, the voice of the bridegroom and the voice of the bride, the voice of them that shall say, praise the Lord of hosts, for the Lord is good, for his mercy endureth forever, and of them that shall bring the sacrifice of praise mm -hmm. into the house of the Lord. Good God mm -hmm. Almighty. For I will cause to return the captivity of the land as, as, as it was at before. the first mm -hmm. said the Lord. My, 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 my. Wow. Now, you see that it says the voice of joy and the voice of gladness, the mm -hmm. voice of the bridegroom and the voice of the bride, uh -huh. the voice of them that shall say, praise the Lord. 
Hmm. You know, beloved, sometimes we go into the church's house and you know what? We won't even open our mouths to say praise the Lord. Okay. Hmm. Somebody have to tell you, say praise the Lord. And then even when they say, say praise the Lord, sometimes we still don't say praise it. Praise the Lord. <laughs> you know, we, we're so dry. With so it. dry. Lift your hands. You put your hands up like you. But the police will tell you, lift up, you go way up here. <laughs> <laughs> but yes, but you, you tell them in the, in the church, lift your hands. They do like the incognito. You know why? Because they're not living the life. Uh oh, is that what it is? That's what it is. Okay. Because when you live the life, oh, shine! Hey, hallelujah! Come on, you you up there? You up yes, there? You up there? You give it all up to God. Yes. Amen. Yes, yes, you give yes. Give it all up to Him. But you know what? You got to have Him in you in order to give Him praise. Right. If you don't have Him in you, you can't praise something that you don't have that in you. Don't you. have in you. That's if there ain't true. nothing in the cup, ain't nothing gonna come out of the cup. Mm -hmm. Amen. That's good. That's Amen. Good. Amen. 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 And it says, <laughs> and it says, here, the voice of them that shall say, "Praise the Lord of hosts." Yes. For the Lord is God, good, for His mercy endureth forever. And then, and, and of them that shall bring the sacrifice of praise into the house of the Lord. For I will cause them to return the captivity of the land. You got to bring a praise with you when you come to church. Yes. You got to bring a hallelujah with you when you come yes, to church. Yes, you do. You got to bring a thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Because something God has done for you. You got to say glory. Uh -huh. Yes, you do. Uh -huh. Yes. Hey. You got to say amen sometimes. Amen. Come on. Good God Almighty. But some of us don't open our mouths for nothing. And if we do, hallelujah. No, like God don't get no glory out of that. Hmm. He says, he said, praise me with all of your heart, with all right. of your mind, with right. all of your soul, with right. all of your strength. How you going to praise God uh, uh, with all your strength? Hallelujah. That ain't your, all your strength. <laughs> That ain't all of your strength. That's wrong. Oh, but that's right. I know it is. That's right. I mean, God wants it all. Yes. He says, make a joyful noise unto me. Yes. When you come in my house, not even before you get in my when you get on the courts. Come on. When you get in on, on the premises. Come on, the premises. Come on, come on. Start shouting. Start yes. praising me. Yes, start yes, giving yes. me glory. Start thanking me. Woo, Shundo. Because why? I brought you here. I right. brought you here. Safe. Right. Good God Almighty. Whatever you come back of that whole week. And you get ready to go to church, your mind ought to be so geared up. Yeah. I got to get in this house. Yeah. I got to give God some praise. I got to give God some worship. Like you said, I got to say, God, I thank you. Yeah. You kept me. The car didn't run over me. Come on. That's I didn't it. get killed. Come on. I didn't get sick. Come on. You got to be thinking about those type of things when you're on your way. You got to say, God, I thank you. Yes. I couldn't pay my bills. You sent somebody by my house yeah. and gave me some money. Or you sent it in the mail. Come, Come on. on. Ah, ah, you you got to do that. Mail. Come on. Good God, I'm the little shade. Yes. You got to do that. Oh, God said, wake up Jesus. and praise him. Don't you know when you do that, it brings more? Yeah. He'll give you more. More. Ah, <laughs> she keep on praising me. She keep on lifting me up. Yeah. I got to give her this. Yeah. I got to give him that. Yeah. Come on, y'all. Uh, yeah, that's it. That's it. We got to praise we him. We got to praise him. Got to God praise Almighty. him. For all that he's done for us. You know what? And, 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 beloved, let me just put this in your uh, spirit right quick. You can't give yourself nothing. Mm-mm. You can't do nothing for yourself. It's mm -mm. all about God it's doing all about it for God. you. It's all about when I wake God. up in the morning, I say, God, thank you for a new day. Yes. Thank you for last night. Because yes. something could have happened to me during the come night. On, but come, look, on, come on, come on. Give me praise when you wake up in the morning. Yes. When I go and open up the windows, I say, Lord, thank you that I can see. I got eyes to see. I can hear. I got ears to hear. I got legs to walk. Thank you. Somebody don't have that this morning. Right, 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 right. God Almighty. So you can't do nothing for yourself. Because why? The Lord, the joy of the Lord is my strength. strength. Good God Almighty. Yes, he is. He is the one that move, makes me move, live, and have my, my being. being in him. Yes, he is. I can't do nothing. If he would tell me that, if he would just, what, take that breath from me, I would just be like this. Come on. I use as, a, as an illustration. All of us got a lot of clothes in our closet. Mm -hmm. Those clothes are dormant until you put them on your body. They get, they don't as remember. long as there's laying up in, hanging up in your closet, they're nothing until you put them on. Right. Ah, oh, that's what happens when we are, uh, um, uh, we like, like uh, 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 what a garment. Yeah, until the Holy Ghost come up in us. Come uh -huh. on. Uh -huh. 
We nothing until he comes there. And he makes the difference. And he makes the difference. Yes, exactly. He yes, he does. Exactly. He makes up the difference. Amen, amen. Uh, so let's learn how to praise him. Let's hmm. learn to say amen. Yeah. Let's learn to say hallelujah. Hallelujah. Let's learn to say thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Let's learn to say I love you, Jesus. Come yes, on, God. Yes, 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 yes. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Ooh, glory to God. We're going to a new Naaman. Uh, Na Nahum. Nahum. Nahum is in the Old Testament. It's right after Micah, which is in the Old Testament, and right before Habakkuk. And we're going to Nahum, uh, chapter 1, verse 7, and it says, The Lord is good, a stronghold in the day of trouble, mm -hmm. and he knoweth them that trust in him. All right. Are you mm, sure? I can't that's, find that. Yeah. Right he says right after Micah. Right there. There it is. This is it's a yeah, small It's a small, book. it's a one page. Yeah, here. and you and my, my I don't have no ridges. All right, let's go to that uh one seven. Mm -hmm. One and seven, and then says what now? The Lord is good, a strong hope in, in the, the day, day of trouble. trouble. Oh, don't y'all know that? Haven't y'all went through some stuff mm -hmm. and then and couldn't get out of some stuff? Yes. But God came around and God hmm. did it for you. Amen. When the when the white man or the black man or the or the businessman or whatever man say I, I can't help you, and then you go to another one and God's what opened up his heart, right? And he what gives you what you stand in need of. The Lord is good, a stronghold in the day of trouble. Yes. And He knoweth them that what trust in Him. God knows you. Do you know Him? Come on. But He knows you. The Lord is good and He's a strong. He, he's strong. Mm -hmm. he, uh, Hold on to him mm -hmm. in the day of trouble. Hold on to him. Ask him for what you need. Ask him for what you want. Oh, good God. God is a refuge. Yes, he is. He's a fortress. Yes. Mm, a hiding place. God knows his saints, and he knows who they are. Amen. Yes, he does. We can't fool him. We can fool people, but we can't fool God. God knows that we're living true. God knows that we're his. Amen? Yes, he does. Yes, he does. Now we're going into the New Testament. Mm -hmm. uh, what is that scripture? That's John. John, St. John, the first chapter, verse 48. St. John, or John, 148. It mm -hmm. says, Nathaniel said unto him, Whence knowest thou me? <laughs> Jesus answered and said unto him, Before that Philip called thee, when thou wast under the fig tree, I saw thee. Good mm. God Almighty. Mm. Mm. That's a good one. Right yeah, yeah. See, God knows where you are. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's why we can't hide from him. Uh, he knows everything we do, everything we say, everywhere we go, who we go with, mm -hmm. who we be with. I mean, God knows everything about us. We can't hide from him. They used to uh, sing a song, come out of that corner, you can't, you can't, you can't hide. <laughs> come out that corner, you can't hide. Yeah. Amen, because we can't hide from him. And so Nathaniel wanted to know, God, how you know me? How, how, how do you know me? Well, see, God knows everything because he's God. Right. Uh-huh. And he says, before that Philip came, called thee, mm -hmm. when thou was under the fig, he told him exactly where he was. Right where he was. Uh-huh. Have you ever had God to tell you? Exactly what you ask him to yes. tell you. Yes. Yes. And show you some things. Yes. Amen. I remember one night uh, we were in Los Angeles at the time, and um, I used to work for the sheriff department. So the choir and some of the members had went out to dinner, and I had to work, and I didn't know where they were. So what I did, I asked the Lord. I said, Lord, where are they tonight? <laughs> and it was really something. They had went to the Redondo Beach area, and it was at the restaurant where we never, ever frequent. And it was so funny. They, I had them to page her. I said, could you please page Geneva Alexander? <laughs> and so what happened is when they paged her over the intercom, the choir was like, who know you out here? We, we, we don't come out here. And my mom said, it ain't nobody but Darlene. Because she showed me how to get in contact with the Lord to get results. And, and, use it and I used it. <laughs> I use it all the time. Right. It works. It works. When you have that relationship. It works. And I remember a sweet sister of mine called herself going to go out one night. <laughs> and mother didn't even ask her where she was going. And see what happened is when, you, when you parents have that connection with the Lord. Children, let me tell you something. 
you cannot pull the wool over your parents' eye no, as you think no, you are doing. No, you sure because can. when you have that connection, that straight on connection, God will let you know. Mm -hmm. Sometimes he, you won't even have to ask him, he'll just tell you. Yeah. And this particular night, it was so funny. <clears throat> um, the Lord had told my mom where my older sister went. She called and said, I'm just going to go out. And so what happened is she just said, oh, okay. Now, she's in the kitchen minding her own business. Mopping the floor. Mopping the floor. <laughs> and the Holy Spirit told her exactly where she was. <laughs> and she was like 45 minutes out of L.A. Uh -huh. And when she came home, she said, I know exactly where you've been. <laughs> and my sister's eyes bucked. Yeah. And what happened is she said, you've been so-and-so place. Mm -hmm. And she said, huh, how you know that? You don't have that, you, you have that connection. And I didn't even ask God. No, he just told you. He just told me. He asked me, he says, where is your child? <laughs> and I said, Lord, I don't know. Where is she? <sighs> you know, like, where is she? And he said, she's in Orange County. I said, oh, okay. I was okay because he knew where she was. But I, don't know, I already knew he knew where she was, but he told me where she was. Yeah, so he when told she came you. In and so she was fixing to start telling me a lie. <laughs> and I said, I know where you've been. <laughs> What? I said, I know where you've been. Oh my I said, God goodness. told me you were in Orange County. Mm. And boy, her eyes got big as her head. Yeah. See, God God knows when you care about your children. Come on, Pastor Mom. He knows that you can't keep your eyes on your children always. But he can. But he has an eye in oh, every place. Eye. It's in every place. Come on. Beholding the good and the evil. Yes. So we can't hide nothing from him. Amen. Amen. So let's stop trying to hide from God. Let's just let's just be open with it. Be open and honest. Be open and honest. And you know what? He loves that. Yes, he does. Because if if you're doing wrong, he can get you right. Mm -hmm. Woo, yes, he can. Yes. Yes, he can get you right. Let's go now. We're going to where St. Matthew 19 chapter, the 16th and 17th verse of Matthew 19 chapter 16 through 17. Mm -hmm. And it says, And behold, one came and said unto him, Good master, what good thing shall I do that I may have eternal life? And he said unto him, Why callest thou me good? There is none good but one, that is God. But if thou wilt enter into life, keep the commandments. That's the how, that's that's how, how you get in. You. That's how you get in. That's and that's how, how you get in. That's how that you got to be uh, keep the commandments in order to get in. He says, right. why call it thou me good? This is Jesus is talking. Mm -hmm. And he said, there is none good but one. Right. And that is God. Mm -hmm. Well, he, he, that God was right there with him because why? The Trinity always run always together. Always run together, right? Mm -hmm. And so he says, uh, "None good, none is good, what? But one, and that is God. Mm -hmm. But if thou will enter into life, keep the commandments. If you want, if you it, want eternal on. life, come on, come on, come on. If you want to live with come him, on, keep him. If you want to reign with him, uh -huh. then what? You got to keep his commandments, right?" And his commandments are not grievous. They're not hard. It's just you making up your mind to do, to do the right thing. Mm -hmm. Amen. I, I, it took me a while to make up my mind. But baby, when I had the encounter with him, when I had that encounter with him, it wasn't hard for me to make my mind up. Because I never had anybody to love me like that. He loves me. Amen. Right, right. And so it wasn't hard. If we want eternal life, we've got to keep his commandments. Mm hmm if we want to see Jesus in peace, we got to keep his commandments. If we want to live holy, we got to keep his commandments. Mm -hmm. And that would keep us what? Living holy. Oh, right. blessed be the name of the Lord. Oh, it's almost time. We're almost there. We're almost there. Almost there. Romans the 11th chapter in the 22nd verse. Romans eleven twenty two says, Behold, therefore the goodness and severity of God on them which fail, severity, but toward thee, goodness. If thou continue in his goodness, hmm. otherwise thou also shall be cut off. Good God Almighty. Well, behold, it means to watch this. Mm -hmm. Listen to this. Take heed. Hear this. Come on. Take heed. Understand mm. this. The goodness and what severity of God mm -hmm. is the quality of being what severe. Uh -huh. Even when we fall. The goodness of God is there for us. Yes. If we continue in his goodness, if not, we will be cut off. Yes. With God Almighty. My Lord Jesus. We got to continue what? That's in his commandments. Right. 
in his goodness, in his, goodness, in uh -huh. his favor, uh -huh. come on. If we want to do that, then we got to what? If we don't, we're going to be what? Cut, cut off. off. I don't want to be cut off. What about you? I know you don't want to be cut off. Exactly. You want to live eternally. So we got to keep the goodness of God on the good side of us. Amen. Right, right, right. On the good side of us. We as Christians must what? Have perseverance. Oh, we got to persevere. Persevere. It's our, in our lives. Mm -hmm. Step by step, we have to make this journey. Even though the way seems hard. Mm -hmm. We have to hold on and hold out yes. until our change come. Oh, Thank bless God. his holy name. Hey, 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 oh, bless his holy yeah, name. God, yeah, God. Bless his holy name. Now we got another, we got two more scriptures, I think. Three more, a few more. Yeah, a few more. Which one you want us to do? Uh, we're going to Job. Back in the Old Testament, Job chapter 17 and verse 9. And it says. The righteous also shall hold on his way. And he that have clean hands shall be stronger and stronger. <laughs> Strength. Good All God right. Almighty. Okay. When, uh, okay. When your hands are clean. Mm -hmm. Good God Almighty. Strengthen. Mm -hmm. Strength comes. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. We get stronger and stronger when our hands are clean. Right. Mm-hmm. When we try, when we try, so well, but when we're tried up in, when we're tried up, tied up, I'm sorry, when we're tied up in mess, in sin, mm. in things that are what? Not pleasing to God. Right. Good God Almighty. Right. Okay, we got to get it right mm -hmm. if we want to what? See him. Right. And a lot of us got our hands in some wrong places, <laughs> in some wrong things. Yes. Doing some wrong stuff. Come on, Pastor. You cannot do stuff wrong and, mm -hmm. and, and think you're not going to get by. Right. Oh, you might think you'll get by, but you won't get away. Because God got you. God got you. He's watching you. Yeah. And a lot of times we know we're doing wrong. Come on, Pastor. And then we'll, we'll, we'll sit up in church and try to pretend like we're so holy. Mm. And we know we're doing wrong. You know what? I have a little thing on my page, and it says, um, oil and water don't, don't mix. mix. Don't mix. And it also says, neither does the anointing mix with being messy. No, it doesn't. No, it, it does not. The, the anointing don't even get around mess. Uh-uh. It, it don't get on mess. It don't, mm -hmm. it, 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 no, you got to come clean. Come clean. You got to come clean. All the you way out. Come clean. Yes. yes. And, 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 if, and if we are, our hands will get stronger and stronger. Mm -hmm. Amen. The Lord will use us mightily. Right. More exactly. and more. Amen. Exactly. We got to rush this up now because we're move, moving out of time. Let's go to First Peter. First Peter, back in the uh, New Testament. First Peter chapter 1, verse 13 says, Wherefore, gird up the loins of your mind. Good God Almighty. Be sober and hope to the end for the grace that is to be bought. I'm going to say brought unto you at the revelation of Jesus Christ. Let me read that again. Wherefore, Wherefore gird up the loins of your mind. Tighten up your mind. Be sober and hope to the end for the grace that is to be brought unto you at the revelation of Jesus Christ. You got to be fixed up when it comes. That's what it means. Get, Get right. Almighty. Get right. Gird up your loins. Yes. Put, put the truth around you. Yes. Put on the breastplate of righteousness. Come yes. on. Get fixed up because he's coming. Yes. And so if you're not ready when he comes, you, you're going to miss it. No, Lord Jesus. Oh, my God. Well, don't let it be said too late. Right. Oh, gird up your loins. Uh -huh. Peter gives us. Uh, uh, exhortation of hope to holiness. Mm -hmm. I mean, to be sober in your mind. Don't let Satan or mm -hmm. anyone mess up mm -hmm. your mind. Right. Gird it up with truth. Mm -hmm. Keep it safe. Be sober and mm -hmm. hope until the end the promise God has what said to you. Mm -hmm. What has he said to you? My Lord Jesus. So, don't let Satan mess with your mind. Right. Because that's the only thing he can get to is your mind. Right. And so baby, keep your mind stayed on Jesus. Keep your mind clean. Keep your mind pure. So Satan can't get. Not only Satan, people, a Thank lot you. of people want to just mess you up because why? God is blessing you, blessing you. Blessing and, you. And they're angry with you because right. God's blessing you. Right. No, 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 no. Don't let them mess your mind up. Grunt your mind up and tell them you can be just like me, baby. Right. Just do right. Mm -hmm. Just live right. Just stay right. God will do what, what for, for you what he's done for me. He has no respect to person. But you got to what? Keep your mind. Mm -hmm. Don't let people mess you up right. with your mind. Amen? 
getting on for something that you don't have no business off into. You know, I think about the dope. I've never been a dope addict or never been, don't even know what dope look like. Mm -hmm. But what happens is, I just imagine how, how that people can get so mixed up and messed up with dope. And if, if, if the dope makes somebody else crazy, Come on, Pastor. why would you, you take the dope? That you can handle it. You can't handle it. Come they couldn't on. handle it. Neither Come can you. On. Why Come would on. you want to try it? Right. If you never try it, what? Then you'll never want it. Right. Exactly. But exactly. people are like, oh, no, it ain't going to do me like that. It ain't going right. to do me like that. And they get you hooked on it. Let me mess your mind up. Come mm -hmm. on. Tell them to hook you on Jesus. Amen? <laughs> yes. Get hooked up yes. on Jesus. Yes. That's the best thing you can do. Yes. That's we're, awesome. We're, uh -huh. Where are we now? St. John, the 15th chapter, the 9th and 10th verse. Again, St. John, the 15th chapter, the 9th and the 10th verse says, As the Father hath loved me, mm -hmm. so have I loved you. Mm -hmm. Continue ye in my love. Mm -hmm. If ye keep my commandments, mm -hmm. ye shall abide in my love, even as I have kept my Father's commandments and abide in his love. Continue ye in what? My love. If you keep my commandments, ye shall what? Live, dwell, abide mm -hmm. forever in his love. Thank you, Lord. So keep pressing woo, unto the end. Right. It, 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 this is a pressing way. It, yes, it's it not, is. It's a straight and a narrow way, and it's a pressing a way. A pressing way. You've got to press on and keep on going, and don't turn around. If you turn around, well, if you're on a straight and narrow road, you, you can't, can't turn, turn around. around. you got to keep going. Amen? Mm -hmm. got to keep going. I'm rushing now because the time is coming out. Let's go to Hebrews. Hebrews 12, 1 and 2. In the New Testament, Hebrews 12, 1 and 2 says, Wherefore, seeing we also are compassed about with so great a cloud of witnesses, mm. let us lay aside every weight and the sin which doeth so easily beset us, mm -hmm. and let us run with patience the race that is set before us, mm. looking unto Jesus, the author and finisher of our faith, yes. who, for the joy that was set before him, endured the cross, yes. despising the shame, and yes. is set down at the right hand of the throne of God. Good God, God, God Almighty. Almighty. Yes. Uh-huh. Lay aside every mm. weight and the sin. Mm -hmm. That thing that gets you that off gets you track. Off. Mm. Mm. That gets you mixed up and messed yes. up. That thing that keeps nagging at you mm -hmm. and keep you... Uh, from getting close to the Lord. That yes. thing that do, uh, it says do away with that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm, with it. And, and, and we must have what? Patience, patience to run the race. Right. Remember the race is not given to the swift. Nor the strong. Nor the strong, but to he what? Him that didn't do it. Do it to the end. Mm -hmm, so the race, we're in a race, y'all. We got to keep on moving. We got to move fast. Right. Amen. Right. Well, you can't run no race slow. No. Nah. You got to run as fast as you can go. That God has set before, he set the race before us so because he knew we could win if we could keep our eyes on him. Yes, God. Looking unto Jesus Christ, who is the author and the finisher of our faith. Jesus Christ is our goal. He is our what? Eyes on mm. the author. Keep our eyes on, on the, the author. author. Oh, the my God. And the finisher of our faith. faith. Good God Almighty. If you do that, then you'll win. Yes. You'll win the race. Let's yes, go to Revelations will. now. Revelations 3, chapter 3, verse 11 says, Behold, I come quickly. Uh -oh. hmm. Hold that fast which thou hast, that no man take thy crown. Good God Almighty. Woo! Ooh, Jesus. Whoa. Jesus is telling us I the event quickly. is near. Good God Almighty. He says, Be watchful, keep pressing, because I come quickly. Mm hmm. And my reward is with me. So hold on to what God has given you. Yes. What God's got for you. Hold, yes. on, hold on to what you've been taught. Yes. Hold on, hold on. Uh -huh, to what God promised. Hold on to, uh, to things that you know that is right. Mm -hmm. Let on. no man take your crown. And right. don't let nobody get in front of you to yes. get your crown. Yes, 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 yes. Good God Almighty. Hold on. <laughs> now we're going to the last scripture for tonight. Galatians 6 and 9. Galatians 6 and 9 says, And let us not be weary Woo! in well-doing. Well yes, Lord. For in due season we shall reap <laughs> if we faint not. Good God mm. Almighty. Let us not get tired nor worn, worn out. Worn out. Come on. Mm -hmm. In well-doing. Don't uh -huh. do that. Uh -huh. 
when it is our season, when it's our time, we will reap yes. the harvest. Yes, oh, yes. God, have mercy. The reward will be ours yes. if we just hold on to God's unchanging hand. Yes. Everybody has a due season. A due season. And we shall reap if we faint not. Don't faint now. So don't faint in the waiting, waiting room. room. Mm -hmm. <laughs> While yes. you're waiting, don't faint. Yes. Because if you faint, you're not going to read. My Lord Jesus. While we're waiting, keep busy. Yes. Keep working. Yes. Keep healing. Yes. Keep delivering, folks. Yes. Keep God in your business. Yes. Woo! Keep God's people. Keep them pulling and come on for him. Amen. Yes. Pulling yes. sinners out of the, the fire. fire. Yes. Tell them about Jesus. Yes. Who can save anybody. Yes. And everybody. Yes. That want to be saved. Yes. Get God a so don't faint. Don't faint in the waiting room. In the waiting Good room. Good God Almighty, I'm waiting on something. Yes. Because God has promised me something. Yes. And I'm waiting on. I'm not gonna faint. I'm not gonna give up, and I'm not gonna give in. I'm gonna hold on yes. till God comes. Yes. I'm gonna hold on till He changes the situation. I'm Thank gonna you, hold Jesus. on until He fix the problem. Yes. So don't faint in the waiting room. In the waiting room. God bless you tonight. I hope. That something have been said tonight that yes. will encourage you to hold on yes. to God's unchanging hand. That you know how the goodness of God, good God Almighty, that you, 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 you'll share that love and that kindness and that love of God. You need to just speak it to Thank people. You, Jesus. Let people know that people are hurting. They need to know that they're loved. Yes. Tell them God loves them. Yes. But he hates their sin. Yes. Ooh, good God Almighty. We got to start witnessing y'all. Mm -hmm. We got to start telling people about the goodness of God. Amen. Yes. You know how good he is to you. Just tell them what he's done for you. Yes. And everything will be all right. Yes. Ooh, God bless you tonight. God I love you back. I love all of you back. Oh, blessed Savior, blessed Savior, who can't find in the waiting room? Good God Almighty. Hallelujah, oh, wow. hallelujah. If I were you tonight, Is it a I would not be caught dead without Christ in my life. Yes. God bless you. We'll see you next week. God bless you. I just wanted to tag on what you said about being patient in the waiting room. Yes, Lord. I got a word from a, a, a good friend of mine who sent me a video today, and it was so powerful. And it was a prophet on the line, and he was saying, the delay is over. Mm. You've been waiting on something for such a long time. Yes, He Lord. says, the delay is over. I receive that. And I feel the anointing on me right now. I receive that. And I said, that. God, I think he said, some of y'all been waiting on yes. some promotions. Some of y'all been waiting on, he said, buildings. My he God. said, some of y'all been waiting on a, a good report. Mm -hmm. He said, all type of, Ooh, he geez. said, the delay God said it's over. I said, Hallelujah. Thank you. thank you. Because we've been waiting a long time. I see that. And what happened is in his time, mm -hmm. uh, that's when he moves. That's in when his he moves. Time. In his time. It's not what we wanted. Sometimes we want it real, real quick. Mm -hmm. But oh, he's yeah. orchestrating in the background, mm -hmm. rearranging things just for you and I. Yes. So when we get there, it's a done deal. Right. And I thank God for that tonight. I oh, thank God yes. tonight for this lesson tonight. And I thank God that. The good that we do have a God that's full of goodness, yes, the goodness of God, and when we what have what received Him as our Lord and Savior, ah, uh, we have a part yes. of the promises. promises. So, yay and amen. amen. Yes, Lord. If you do not know Christ as your Lord and Savior, this is a perfect opportunity for you to come to Him ah mm -hmm. uh, while the water is Ooh, troubled. Jesus, Jesus. The angel of the Lord has set this water on. Oh, uh, 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 yeah. He has traveled the water tonight. Yes. And Jesus. whatever you need, this is a perfect Ooh, opportunity Jesus. to come to you right uh -huh. now. Dear Jesus, Dear Jesus, I am a sinner. I am a sinner. And I am lost without and you. I'm lost without you. Forgive me of my sins. Forgive me of my sins. I repent. I repent. I believe that you are the Son of God. I believe that you, you are the Son of God. You died. You were buried. You were buried. And you rose again. And you rose again. Lord, save me. Lord, save me. From my sins. From my sins. I receive you. I receive you. As my Lord and Savior. As my Lord and Savior. Sit on the throne of my life. Sit on the throne of my life. And be the Lord and Savior of my life. Lord and Savior of my life. Fill me up. Fill me up with your Holy Ghost, with your Holy Ghost. and write my, name write my name in your book. In your book. If you repeated that, you're yes, now a part yes, of God's yes. family. Thank you, Lord. And if you have stepped away, mm. you got drawn away. My God. You got pulled away. My God. Somebody said something and you were drawn away. My God. You need to ask God to forgive you. you. Yes. Because you have backslidden. Mm -hmm. And now you need to be what? Reclaimed. Reclaimed. 
restored yeah. back to the arms of God. He's married. He's married, He's married to, to the, the backslider. Back yeah. All you have to do is say, Lord, I'm sorry. Yes. Please forgive me. Take me back. Lord, uh, receive me back. Yes. And I guarantee you, if you said that, you're back in the fold of, of the safety arms of the Lord Jesus Christ. And walk in his ways. And you walk in his ways now. Yes. How do you do that, Pastor? Oh, you just walk in his ways. You covenant. start walking. You start walking Read in the, the scriptures. scriptures. You start Read what? The truth. Speaking the truth. Yes. Living you start the truth. giving into your Bible classes yes, at your church. God. Yes, God. Into your Sunday school. Jesus. Into your Christian education. And I guarantee you, you that your foundation Ooh, will be strong and stable. Thank ah, you you won't have a spirit to want to move about. Yes, God. Because you want to stay with him. Yes, God. Ah. He's yes. there right now. Yes, he is. Wait. And I thank you so much for those who have received him as your yes. Lord and Savior. Yes. And those of you who have been back, uh, have been reclaimed back. Mm -hmm. And if you're looking for a church home, just inbox me for wherever you stay. And we will get to, together and find a church in your vicinity. And that church should and all be filled with the Holy Ghost. Yes. Yeah, because it does make a difference. It makes a difference. It makes a big difference. Yes, it does. If your church are activating and utilizing the fivefold ministry, uh -huh. it does make a difference. It does make a difference. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. Ooh, Jesus. Watch God begin to utilize you in ministry. Right, right. You'll start speaking. Yes. You'll start being Holy Ghost boldness will mm -hmm. come on you. Yeah, we And are. you don't care what folks say about I know you. That's right. That's how it works. Yeah, that's the way it works. And that's the way it does work. Mm -hmm. There's so many of you online tonight. Thank you. And Jesus. I want to just thank y'all so much. I love all the love that's coming love. across oh, the screen. All the love. And I want to tell a special Jesus. thank you for Minister James Jackson. Thank you. Uh, he was instrumental in getting his choir online tonight. It was a whole bunch of you all online Bless tonight. You tonight. And I'd like to read off your names while we have a little time left. I want to thank Minister Charlie Cook, Bless you. Uh, Laquita Nichols, Bless you. Uh, Minister Brenda Hardy, Bless you. Pastor Erling Williams, Bless you. Minister James Jackson, yes. uh, Lady Angela or uh, Angel uh, Cox, uh, Mr. David Evans, wow. Colleen Charles Tonzi, uh, Cassandra Galloway, Galloway wow. uh, Mr. James Robinson, mm -hmm. uh, Sharon Hall, okay. my Freedom Riders, yes. uh, my my best friend Madalena and Willie Flores. Pastor Donald Robinson, wow. Judy Logan, Praise Dante God. Duckett, <laughs> my godson's son, wow, uh, wow. Prophetess Rotonda Morgan, yes. uh, uh, Steve Sangster, Gloria Wilson, mm. Lehman DeBose, Marva Thornton, God bless you, sweetie, mm. Alana Paul, I think that's Minsa, uh, Minsta, uh, Brett, uh, Randy Woods, my Aunt Pauline McDowell. Wow. And also uh, Evangelist Patricia Williams. God bless you, my sister. God bless you. Um, <laughs> James Jackson is asking for prayer for his move to the West Coast. Oh, oh bless you. You're going to the West Coast. Woo. Yes. Okay, buddy. All right. <laughs> Call me. Call me. Let's talk. God bless you tonight. We want to go ahead and do that tonight. And we just, again, want to thank you all so much. If you have... Uh, came on at the end of this particular uh, lesson. I admonish you to go back and review it. It is a powerful a word was given out tonight by our teacher Amen. and my pastor mom, Pastor Geneva Alexander. Sure. And um, we're going to ask, my husband is sitting right here. I'm going to ask him to pray Pacific. for specifically for uh, Mr. Minister James Jackson and his move. From the East Coast to the West Coast. Oh, and well. then I'll pick you back on that. Amen. God is going to bless you there. This God. evening, our Heavenly Father, yes, dear Lord, we God come Jesus. to say thank you. Thank yes, you. God. Father God, we thank you for your word. Yes, yes. We Jesus. thank you for what was given out tonight. Thank yes, you. Father God. God, we come lifting up our brother. Yes. Brother James Jackson, oh yes, God. God. Oh, Father God, we Jesus. ask you, oh God, to touch him right touch now, God. Right now. Oh, Father God, as he moved from the East Coast yes, to the God. West Coast, yes, God. Oh, Father God, we ask you to. Go before, go before him, God. Yes, God. Prepare the way, God. Oh, Father God, make the move easy, God. Yes, God. 
in the name of Jesus, God. Give him strength, God. Help him to make the right decision, God. Help him, oh, Father God, to to open up the right door, God, to make the right turn, God. Oh, Father God, give him, oh, God, what you want him to have, God. Direct his path, God, right now, God, in the name of Jesus. Let him know that you're with him, God. Let him know that you're right beside him, God. Let him know that you're behind him, God. Let him know that you're in front of him, God. Let him know that you're all around. Oh, God. Bless Come yes, in with God. your blood, God. Yes, Protect him, God. Sunday, As he go down the highways, yes, airways, yes, byways, yes, God. however yes, way, God. Yes, go yes, with him, God, yes, in the Jesus. name of Jesus, yes, God. Yes, God. Oh, Father God, and when he get there. Yes, God. Oh, Father God, when he get there, when God. Yes, oh, Father God, open up the Ooh, windows of heaven. And pour out blessing. You you yes. won't have room to receive, God. Yes, yes, in the God. name of yes, Jesus, God. God. We thank you and we love you, God. Yes, God. We thank you, Father God. Thank you. And we lift him up right yes, now. God, right in Jesus' name, Jesus. God. Jesus. Jesus. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Jesus name. Give him so. strength, God. Yes, strength, right strength for this assignment, yes, God. God. For what you have his hands and his mind and soul and his spirit to do, God. For your glory, man. For your glory, God. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 Now, Father, I pray for those who he leave behind. Yes, yes God. God. I pray that you would undergird them and strengthen them, God. In the name and of that Jesus. you would hold them together, God. Yes, God. I pray for everything that's been taught. Yes. That has been seated into yes, those God. people, God. Yes. That they will, oh God, in the name of Jesus, oh God, uh, uh, keep their hands, oh God, to the plow, God. Yes. Keep yes. their minds focused, God. Yes. As you would lift them up yes, God. in you, God, mm. where they belong, God. Yes, God. I pray, God, for cohesiveness, God, yes. on both ends, God. Yes. You're God. working out something. Yes. Oh, yes, yes, you're doing something yes. right, God. Yes, you are. And it's yes. Marvelous. Yes, God. It's marvelous in our yes, sight, God. Yes. Now, Father, I pray right now, yes. God, in the name of Jesus, yes. God, for the open door, the open door on the Lord. West Coast. Yes. Let it be, oh God, and receive, God, yes. in the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. I pray for every weary person, God, yes, God. that has fallen through the cracks, God, yes, God, that you will resurrect, God, yes. in the name of yes, Jesus, God. God. I pray, God, yes. for those who are online yes. that standing in agreement yes. right now, whatever yes, they need God. Yes, Lord. I pray God yes. in the name of Jesus yes. that you will God move by your power. Yes, Lord. Move by your spirit. Yes. Move by your anointing. Yes, Lord. Move by your word, God. Yes, Lord. Because your word will come back. Uh, yes. To you, Lord. Lord. Yes. Yeah. I thank you right now. Thank yes, Lord. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Bless every household. Yes. yes God. Bless every person on this line. Yes. 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 Bless those yes. who are coming on le- later today. Yes, yes God. Lord. Every need we met. Yes, God. God meet the need in your people. Meet the need, God. Master. God. Whether it's financial, God. Yes. God. Whether it's physical, God. Yes. God. Whether it's spiritual, God. Yes. yes. God. Whether it's emotional, God. Yes, God. Meet the need meet of need, your people. Lord. Yes, God. Yes. Everywhere. Yes. Yes. yes, God. God, we decree and declare Ooh, being Jesus. so. Yes. Because you are the author. Yes, God. And you are the finisher yes. of my faith. Thank you, Lord. And we thank you right now. Thank you. For eyes have not seen. Yes. No, the ears have heard. Yes. The things yes. that you have in store yes, for Lord. us. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Now, oh God, because we walk up Hallelujah. rightly before Ooh, you. Jesus. We ask it all, God, in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. For the fellowship. For the fellowship. For the friendship. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, glory to Jesus. Yes. Glory to Jesus. Yes. Yes. And it is so. It yes, is God. so. And it is so. Yes, God. And it is so. And it is so. Bless every church that's on this line. Yes, yes Lord. God. Bless the needs of those churches. Yes, yes, Lord. Of those pastors, God. Yes, God. yes. Ah, of those prophets, God, and yes. apostles, God. Yes. Bless the need of your men and women. Let's carry in your word. Thank you, Lord. Let there be no lack. Yes, Lord. Nowhere. Yes, nowhere. Lord. Thank you, oh God, in the name of Jesus, the name yes. of Jesus. that the delay is over. Thank yes. You. In Jesus' Jesus name we pray. Right. For thank Christ's sake, thank God. Thank, thank God. God. Thank God. Thank God. Amen. 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 And, it so. and it is so. And it is so. And it is so. And it is so. God bless you tonight. We love you. All the loves and likes. Ooh, yes. God. Thank you so much. It is so awesome. Uh, again, for the assignment, don't take it lightly, because when God can trust you, uh, he will bless you. Good Amen. God Almighty. Yes. Thank you, Lord. He can trust you, he Ooh, will bless Jesus. you. Thank you, Lord. And tonight, we just want to encourage you all uh, that every we hear somebody asked a question earlier. We're here every Tuesday at 8 o'clock p.m. Central Standard Time for walking in the scriptures and speaking the truth. And on Friday nights, 
my husband and I, Deacon David Spraglin, and uh, myself, we have what we call the Sunday School Golden Nuggets. We help prepare people for their Sunday School classes or Christian education classes on Sunday. And if you do not have a Sunday School class, mm. we are so honored and humble that God would allow us to see the word into you that you may continue to grow yes. in grace yes. and be able to walk out this journey oh, well and equipped. Thank you, God. God bless you tonight. We love you all love so, you much. so, much. so yes. much. Thank you we'll so much. We'll see you next week. I hope you have a remainder blessed week. And I hope and pray that you have an upcoming marvelous weekend. It's been raining here, oh, real bad lately. And I know it's raining on the East Coast. You all um, just keep alert, stay alert, and remember always to what? Put Christ first in everything you do and say. God bless you. Mm, love you too. <laughs> See you next week. God bless you. God bless you.